Um, hi, everybody. This is Mr. Roche. Um, I, we are working with Hangman, and we are laying out the letters for our words, and we want the game to start out like this, okay, with a word laid out. And I want to show you how to do that. It's actually pretty easy to do. We also still have to get rid of our turtle, um, and that's okay. But I wanted to show you basically how this was going to work. Okay, so what we got going on right now is... Um, we have this. We just we don't hide the words. We just actually show the words. Uh oh, um, oh, I have a. Um, let's go spell that. Wait a second. It's um, secret word. Okay. And um, if you run this, um, there you go. We we show words like this. And what we want to do is actually show this. I also want to get rid of the turtle because we're sure where the turtle's going. And that looks pretty good so far. Okay, so uh, one of the things I could do is just take out the show turtle and that or on that. And that's good. Okay. And, um, and there. Okay. So what we want to do, though, is we want to sort of get the letters of each letter of the word. Okay. So we have the secret word. And um, one of the things we could do is just run a loop to um, get each letter, okay? So I'm going to go for um, let, say for example, or letter um, in secret word. Okay, and that's going to set up a loop for me. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to build a string. That's what I had here before. So I'm going to build this other string that I'm going to use instead of the secret word, because I don't want to show people the secret word, right? Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go like this and um, make a, a thing called screen word. That's what I did. Okay. And I'm going to start that to be an empty string. It's going to be nothing. Okay. And then what I'm going to do is for each letter, I'm going to check to see if the letters inside this, um, <laughs> we have a lot of code. Uh, in the correct letters um, list, okay? So as we go for correct letters, we're going to go like this, right? And we'll figure out guessing and stuff like that, but but just to display the word, if the letter's in the correct letters, we'll show it, and if it's not, we'll not show it, okay? That's, that's what we're going to do, okay? And we can play with that in a second. But what's going to go on here right now is that we have the screen word, and then we're going to say this. We're going to say if letter, right, in and then it's called correct letters, right? If it's incorrect letters, then we'll show it, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to build the screen word. I'm going to say screen word, okay? And this is going back to our skills we've got with, with strings. It's going to say plus equals, and then we're going to put in the letter. And to make it fancy, I'm going to put in an extra space, okay? So if the letter's in there, if it's already been guessed and we know it, then we're going to show it, okay? If it's not, which is an else situation, we're going to go like this. Okay, screen word plus equals, and then that's the thing. See, what we're going to do is we're going to show the underscore plus a space, like that. So it's either one or the other. And then what we're going to do is, see, like right now, if I do this, I'll show the word ubiquitous. Yay! Okay. Um, but um, what I want to do is, since that's a secret word, I'm going to show the newly built screen word. And so see how this says screen word instead of um, secret word? And then if I do that, what it'll do is it'll run. And it shows that, which is exactly what we wanted, right? Uh, we have to worry about if it has more than one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten letters, okay? I don't know. So we have to kind of think about that if that's a problem. I, I could I could turn down the fonts a little bit, or I could I could sort of move over a little bit. But um, let me see it because I have it at eighty six, so I'll make it like eighty and see if that looks good. Okay, that still looks good. And then what we can do is we can sort of play with this. I don't know what the word's going to be exactly, but I could say guess and see if there's an A in here. 
So I could say, um, let's let's do all vowels. So it turned out what was going on is that we were um, we were running this. Um, let me do this for a second. Um, if you didn't see it, um, if I run it, it shows up nicely with um, it shows up nicely with the letters, right? That's what we wanted, and it's good. They're basically online with the with the hangman um, gallows and stuff, and that looks good. And then what we want to do is we want to sort of test it out a little bit. And I'm going to try the correct letters. I think it keeps turning off. So what I did was I loaded um, correct letters with some some other letters, right? So if I just run it now, if there's an A, E, I, O, or U in the word, it should show up, which is actually kind of cool. See, there you go. And that's what we're looking for, okay? Um, if we wanted to be fancy, we could draw the lines underneath them, but I think that's pretty good because it still shows you, it still conveys what it does and stuff like that. And then we would have to work on the guessing part and we'd have to sort of say, hey, guess the letter. And then we'd have to play the game like that, okay? So um, that's pretty good. And what I want you to do is, um, one, try this code. This code, this code. Okay, this is a like a loop with an if then in it. And we changed and we added a variable for secret word or screen word and put screen word in here as the thing we show. Okay, so if it shows, that's pretty awesome. And then what I want you to do is um, test it a little bit with um, some some uh, some letters in there, okay? And um, and run it and show me in a, in a video that you have everything done and it runs, okay? So that's basically it. And when you get done, you can take out the letters, right? Um, and then we're going to work on putting the letters into these. And then we have a lot of this program done, which is great. Okay. So that's the homework. The homework is actually to work on um, Hangman and get this piece of it working for your, um, your game. Okay. Um, to finish this off, what we'd have to do is as soon as we're done writing, we have to set T... Um, uh, we just go t dot go to so we have to put the turtle back to position or current load okay we have to send the turtle back and we have to um, t set heading oh um, sorry uh, to finish this off I don't know why my my my, um, my screen thing keeps turning on and turning off because I think of the noise of the keys so if you want to get ahead and finish this up. Um, we have to move the turtle back to where it was. So I'll just do this to, to show you. Okay. And if I go like this now and I run it, it's going to go wherever it did. But see how it's back here now? Now it's ready to play the game. So every time we update the word, we have to move the turtle over here, write the word, and then come back. Okay, and that's what we that's what we're gonna do. Okay, we might also have to do like a clear or something like that too. So um anyway, that's 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 what's it. And um we'll uh we'll uh pick it up from there. Okay, so get that done and talk to you later. Bye.